Hey guys, so I was thinking of switching out my purses. Not that I want to switch from this purse yet whatsoever. I'm obsessed with it. I just feel like I need to give it a little bit of a break because I've noticed that just since I've had it, um, every time I use the zipper, like you can see like some of the blue is coming off a little bit. Um, and I try hard not to be rough with it or anything, but I just want to give it a little bit of a break um, because I don't want it to, to get any worse or anything. Um, so I was thinking of switching to my, my fake Michael Kors purse. Um, it's a lot bigger, so I don't know how I'm going to like using it because I really like the size of my blue purse, but... I'll put everything in there. I'll decide if I like it or not. If not, maybe you can switch purses with me again after I decide which purse to switch to. I was out there looking at all of them, and this is the one that just caught my eye because I haven't used it yet, so I thought I'd give it a try. Um, so yeah, let's just go ahead and put everything into the fake Michael Kors purse. Um, my, I just hit myself in the face with the wrist thing. Uh, my beloved wallet. I really like this wallet that I got from Target. Um, I like it a lot, a lot. My white chocolate Kit Kat. I'm actually going to leave this out. Maybe I'll snack on it. If you haven't tried the white chocolate Kit Kat, you really need to. It's a life changer. It is amazing. Um, gotta have the wet wipes when you have a kid. Um, pen. I'll stick where I can easily find it in one of the inside pockets. Target receipts um, for my last haul that I did. Don't need it. Um, the card that came with my flowers that my friend Abby sent to me, that was so incredibly sweet of her. Like, she messaged me asking me for my address, and she was like, don't ask why. And I honestly thought she was, like, going to invite me, like, to a, her daughter's party or something like that. And then, like, a day later, um, a thing of flowers came for me, and it was from my friend Abby. And it was just, it was so incredibly sweet because she knew that I was having such a hard year um, after my dad passed and everything. Um... So yeah, that's that's what that's from. I was I don't know why I had it in my purse, but I am gonna keep the card. Um, and then I have a little menu from my sister's work in here. I am gonna keep it in my purse just in case I decide to stop by there and try something to eat. At least I'll know what is on the menu. Uh, my sunglasses that I love so much, I'm gonna stick in here. Um, I gotta have my body spray in there. I feel like I need some right now. Mm, it smells so good. Gotta have hand sanitizer because germs are everywhere. Can't go anywhere without my keys. If I get locked out of the house, I'm screwed. My medications, gotta take those with me. I do like how roomy this other Michael Kors is. I won't feel so bad having such a large lotion in this big purse. Um, let's see. We'll do that. I'll stick this in this little back pocket. Um, of course, I gotta keep my lip plumping elf lip glosses in my purse because I do love them and my treat lip beauty. Lip Beauty, my Treat Beauty Lip Balm. And then I have a pack of gum and then three things of Altoids in my purse. I have the giant size wintergreen Altoids, the miniature size, and the miniature size peppermint. I don't know why all three have to be in my purse, but that's just the way it is. And don't judge me for it. But, I mean, again, I mean, you don't want your breath to smell bad. I mean, if you're going to be meeting up with somebody or what have you, like, you want to you wanna have nice breath. And my Tamagotchis are sleeping right now, so I don't need to leave them out to play with them or anything. I'm going to put them in my purse. And my Vaseline lip balm, just have an extra... 
I guess I'll go ahead and throw this Jolly Rancher in there because apparently I gotta have them in my purse at all times. A pack of gum can go in there. I am gonna keep this with my blue Michael Kors since it obviously came with it. Um, I do have an open pack of cashews in there, but I think I'll just leave those out and eat them. The Deerberg's receipt for a water that I bought. I don't need to keep that. And let's see. My all-time favorite lipstick, which I've talked about all the time. My Neo To Go. My lighter that I've been using to light my candle with. And my Burt's Bees lip oil. So this is all essential stuff that I will keep in my purse. Oh, I have another receipt for uh, the gas station when I went and bought my energy drinks. And that is everything except for this penny. That was in there. I think this is one of the pennies that I found. Um, yeah, these two pennies I found, and I'm look like that I think were from my dad. You know, like anytime I find pennies on the ground, um, I look at it as a sign from my dad. So this purse is completely empty. I don't want to stop using it whatsoever. I just want to give it a little break because, like I said, every time I zip and unzip it like I'm just worried that it'll get worse so I'm just giving this baby a little bitty break I will come back to you I promise you're my favorite purse that I've ever owned ever yes I'm talking to my purse um but seriously I am obsessed with this purse so it probably won't take long for me to get it get back to using that purse um but for now I will be toting this bad boy around, and I like that it does have the crossbody, or I can carry it like this if I want, or even like up on my shoulder. Um, it doesn't feel too heavy, which usually bigger purses tend to feel a little heavier. Um, I do have a notebook that I will be keeping in here. It's my YouTube ideas notebook, but I have that out right now because I'm going through all of my ideas to think of other things to do for tonight. I would like to get... Um, several videos done if I can um and actually the other day I found all of this change if you can see all that all of this change at QT in one day in just about the same spot and so like I really took it as a sign that my dad was with me so I keep all that change separate from the change that I spend because I, I don't want to spend that change. Um, I, I mean, if I absolutely had to, I would. But if I can hang on to it and, like, just let it add up, like I've mentioned before, like, see how much change I really do find. And keep, I want to keep it in a separate jar. It'll be, like, my dad's money is what I'll call it. So anytime I find change, no matter where I'm at, I will keep it. I will put it in that jar and just see it how it adds up and see how much there is. Maybe I'll cash it in like if I'm low on money and need money or maybe I'll just keep letting it grow. We'll see. So yeah, that was me switching from my beautiful, real blue Michael Kors. I promise, baby, I will come back to you real soon to my fake big Michael Kors, but I really like this bag and I haven't used it yet, so I have been wanting to use it. And what I like about this purse is it does have this back pocket so I can just slip my phone right in there rather than digging through my whole purse to find it. Um, so yeah, that was this video. I hope you enjoy it. It was short and sweet, um, but I plan on doing some more videos tonight for you guys. I'm not sure what, but I will come up with some kind of idea and I will talk to you later. Bye!